Hi guys. Do you want to make a PFP like this? Then watch till the end of the video and don't miss a single step. First go to Google and search for Pixart APK, now open the first website and download the APK from here. You will need the premium version to unlock all the features. Once the file download is complete, install it. Now again go to Google and search for the player you want. For example, I'll search for Ronaldo Blue Kit, cause that's what I want. Once you find the picture you like, download it. Now open in shot. Click on photo, and new, now select the picture you just downloaded. Now go to cutout. Click on this button to remove the background. Now save this image. Now open PixArt. Select the background for your PFP. Here are some backgrounds, you can screenshot the one you like. I will select this one. Now go to effects, go to colors and select color replace. Now select the main color, which is purple in this case, and replace it with the color you want using hue. I'd recommend you choose the colors of the player's kit. Now add the photo that you saved from InShot. Adjust it as you like. Now we are gonna add CapCut and a light motion logos. You can also add other logos like After Effects, it's up to you. Adjust these logos. Now select the player and click on the Layers button. Now click Move Up. Here are some other ways you can arrange the logos, you can choose the one you like. I will just go with the first one. Now go to Effects. Go to the FX section and select Sharpness. Set the fade to zero. Now add text and write your channel name. Go to colors and then gradient and select two colors, again I'd recommend you choose the kit colors as it looks better in my opinion. Now go to stroke, make it black and set the amount to 15. Now go to font, there are tons of fonts to choose from, you can select the one you like. I personally recommend this font called Chiller STD, you can search for it. Now go to Shadow, adjust Blur and Opacity to 100. Set both the horizontal and vertical position to 0, and the color to black. The watermark is ready, now just adjust it however you like. Now again go to Effects. This time go to Blur and select Focal Zoom. Set Blur to 5, you can do more or less, it's up to you. Now save this image. And your PFP is ready. If you guys like this tutorial and found it helpful, please consider liking the video and subscribing to the channel.